Okay, here we can see, obviously, a banana tree. Now, I know a lot of people have not been on the, uh, the free trips to go on the uh, banana, well, they used to be free, on the banana plantations. I highly recommend it when you come over to Tenerife. Go and check it out. Now, let's start at the top and work our way down. With the leaves themselves, um, they do, and they have done in the past, they made hats out of the leaves, they dried them out, and they'll make hats, and they'll make toys, and they'll make all sorts of things out of the dried leaves. Now when you go down, here you've got your hand of bananas. Now, when you go to the banana plantations, or when you've driven or walked past the banana plantations, you may have wondered why they have the blue bags around the, the uh, bananas. Now the reason they do this is they want the bananas to mature a little bit quicker. Now if you put your banana, even at home, if you put your, if your bananas are green like this and you put it into a plastic bag, they normally use a blue plastic bag over here, uh, I think it's the methane um, will gather inside the bag and it will actually mature and ripen the fruit a little bit quicker. This is why they put the bags over the fruit itself. And as you can see, you've got the massive flower at the bottom here. Now take another look. You've got a little plant here, a little banana plant just here, and you've got the bigger one here. Now when they cut the hand of bananas off, that will die. But don't worry, because they've got another one growing up here. Now when that matures and they cut that one down, they cut the bananas off of that, don't worry, because they've got another one there. And normally you'll have three cycles of the banana plants and the bananas just a little bit of useless information for you, ladies and gentlemen. Now, I've walked up the road just a wee while, a wee bit, I mean. A lot of people will know shambles. As you can see, it's not open. Um, and it's about 1.30 now in the afternoon, on a Monday afternoon. Just going to cross this road, taking care. You've got Harvey's Bar. Once again, it's not open during the daytime. I don't know if these bars are open of an evening, but... At 1.30 in the afternoon, they're not open. This is the Mongolian. I know many, many people eat here. Lovely food, good prices. It gets very, or it used to get very, very busy. Highly recommended as and when we become back up and running and back to the new, new normal. But you've got a few people walking down, look like uh, Canarians or Spanish. I know a few of you will know these bars down here. This is just before the passerella. You've got Taylor's Bar here. Always a busy bar, good food, good staff. That you've got the boys already eating and drinking already. You've got another little souvenir shop here as well. Open. Here you've got Dylan's, the famous Dylan's Bar. Another little shop all your shoes and bits and bobs here you got bar victoria fabulous food in here very very good very good food in here very nice got gigi's up here okay all the boys they're in got their pints in and we know this fella hello just recording for the UK, so they know what's open and what's not open. Uh, you're open. Yeah, me personally. Don't get much money standing there, lad. <laughs> Just up here, you've got happy days as well. So you've got a few people in. Okay, happy days. And then Bojangles as well. And just up here, you've got La Peppa as well. Manhattan's just up here. They've got a few people in. They always have a few people in up here at Manhattan. Over here, you've got the Highland Paddy. As you can see, that's not open. I don't know if it's open in the evenings at all. A few delivery vans. We'll run across the road here. Thanking the lads. Manhattan's up here as I say, nice cocktails in this bar, nice food. Oh, 
all these buildings here. I don't know, obviously, when you last over in Tenerife. Ah, oh, this is what I was talking about, the flamboyant the other day. You need to backtrack on one of my videos, yesterday's video. Um, these are the beans that I was talking about. Yeah. Here, look, they've got the beans. They're green at the moment. And then they turn brown like this. And then when they're like this and they fall on the floor, you can actually use them as a rattle. And that's what I was talking about. Anyway, you've got all these new apartments up here. Very, very nice. You've got a little Ninas or Ninas cash and carry up here for cheaper alcohol and cigarettes, should you need it. I believe this is a very nice Indian here. I don't eat Indian myself, but this is a very nice Indian shop. Feel your lovely curries, tandoori's. Somebody asked me about a herbal shop. There you go. One little herbal shop here as well. Nice herbal shop that one is. This is a lovely place too for your coffees in the mornings. Pizzas, nice little pizza. Look, it's busy in here. Nice coffee. 